Internet access is the lifeblood of a small business. It's fast, it's cheap, and it's easy to get up and running. The hard part is keeping it that way. It can be unreliable, it's famously insecure, and it's a distraction of the century for employees. But with constraints on time and money, most small business owners worry that making it robust would be too expensive and too complex. But you don't need to lose sleep if you get the basics right, and we're going to spend a few minutes showing you how simple it is to improve your internet reliability and ease of external access without spending thousands of pounds or three weeks figuring out the technical side. Now, as a small business, you've got one key problem to sort out, and that's connection reliability. For the minute, forget about viruses and trojans and the configure worm. They're dangerous, of course, but there's a simpler threat that's no less devastating in the short term, and that is the simple failure of your internet connection. One internet service provider, one physical piece of wire, one single point of failure. The end result is you, in an office, essentially cut off from the rest of the world. At best, it's embarrassing, at worst, it's a life and death threat to your business. The good news is, it's an amazingly easy problem to guard against. Now, if you take a look at the front panel of the Draytech 2820 VM router I've got here, you'll see two extra ports compared to a normal router. You've got an extra Ethernet WAN port here, and you've got a USB port here. Now the Draytech can just directly replace a normal broadband router with wireless end capability and you can use these extra broadband connection ports to add what's known as failover to your business broadband connection. And it doesn't need to be expensive. Now the USB port will actually support a standard 3G USB dongle like this, which will just plug straight in. So for the paltry cost of a 3G modem subscription, under £20 a month these days or even less with pay as you go, you get the reassurance that if this happens, you're not cut off from the rest of the world. The connection continues as normal. So now your connection reliability is sorted out and you can get a bit more sleep, you can work on some other important points. A recent survey suggested that one in every eight minutes spent online is spent on Facebook. Now I'm sure you trust your employees, but to make sure staff rules are reinforced and to make sure they're not tempted to spend all day online, the Draytech router has a simple, flexible web interface that allows you to block access to any site or range of sites with a few clicks. So you can block a single site, you can block a class of sites, so here we're blocking all leisure sites. Or you can block sites based on time of day. So for instance, you can remove the block during lunch hour to keep employee morale up by allowing them to check their email and so on. There's absolutely no need to buy a separate web content filtering appliance and it takes five minutes to set up. Now the Draytech router also has virtual private networking. That means your employees can connect back to the office network as if they were actually in the office and it's completely secure. That means home workers can get access to all the same data and assets as someone in the office, and your sales team can do the same when they're on the road. You can even use it to securely connect the network to two offices together without any of the cost of dedicated infrastructure, but with the security of dedicated connection. Take a look at the guide to VPN on this page for more on how to set it up, and to learn about some other simple but effective ways to increase your business security and efficiency with just one piece of hardware.